Hey party people, Andrew here at SHOT 2024, hanging out with Dustin at, with Faxon. Uh, what do you got that's new this year? We got several things. I think probably the, the first one we'll want to touch is 22 Arc. So, you know, what is it? 22 Arc. It's a new round from Hornady. Okay. So they announced it last year at uh, NASGW, which is a show for wholesale distributors. And they had contacted us a few months before. They're like, hey, can we get some Grindel bolt carrier grips from you? I'm like, sure, what, what's up? And, like, and it ended up they were developing a new round. and. Uh, this uh, 22 arc, we actually have it built up in a prototype AR-15 right here. But this is really just uh, another AR-15 swappable cartridge. So you get the barrel, you have the 6.5 Grendel bolt carrier group, and you're pretty much off to the races. And 6.5 Grendel being based on 7.62 by 39 case. Right. right? So right. that's why we've got this aggressively curved AK magazine. You got it. You got it. So we have three barrel skews, a 16, a 20, and a 24 inch that'll actually start shipping next month. Dealers have already started ordering those. And then later in the spring, we have uh, slated some complete AR-15 uppers as well as complete firearms. So this is one we mocked together using one of our extra light receiver sets in B5 furniture. Uh, but very interesting stuff. If you go to factsandfirearms.com slash 22art, um, you'll see all the information from Hornady on the ballistics and things of that variety. So okay. a very cool bridging of the gap between uh, a, a Rimfire 22 and, you know, like a 22 Creed Moor or a 2250. The other item was uh, that we launched the FX7 series of bolt actions last year, uh, late last year, and we've added a, a new 8.6 Blackout gun to that lineup. So this is on a okay. Magpul Hunter stock. So the FX7 uh, bolt action, short action series, uh, it came out in October and uh, it started with a couple of precision rifles, a lot of barreled actions, two standalone actions. Uh, those have been available since October. This guy just hit the price list, just hit the website. Uh, so dealers could start ordering those, picking them up. So this will be a complete uh, 8.6 with a 16 inch barrel, one of our prefit barrels and both the action and barrel are made from bar stock in our Greater Cincinnati facility. We always get questions about when's the ARAC gonna be back yeah. and all that sort of stuff. And so we actually started shipping them again last year. And actually, if you go to various dealer websites, you'll see some of them have uppers already. Uh, so we, we have brought the ARAC back into production and have been shipping since October. So this is actually what brought us to market. Uh, the ARAC 21, it's our AR-AK hybrid uh, with user adjustable gas, non-reciprocating forward charging handle. It is a long stroke gas piston system. But the great thing about it is the upper itself drops onto any mil-spec AR-15 lower. Oh, so you could sweet. buy the complete rifle or you could just get the upper and put it on a previous build. Uh, the buffer tube is just a dummy just to hold the stock. It can shoot folded. Um, we will have options later in the year to have a pick rail lower. Uh, so if you want to put a folder on there, or whatever. All recoil systems up in here. You got it. All the reciprocating parts are right up there in the upper. So uh, these are available in 762 by 39 as well as 556 in either a 12 and a half barrel, uh, 12 and a half inch barrel length or 16 inch. Okay. And then if you get one and you want to swap it to the other caliber, we also sell barrel assembly units. So you just take a couple of screws out pull your BAU out, put the other BAU in, adjust your gas and you're off to the races. Oh, nice. So those have uh, been shipping and are back out on the market. And uh, then the newest thing we may want to move is uh, the Faxon Outdoors line that just launched last year. All right, so we got a bag here. Feels like it's pretty waterproof. Yeah, this is uh, part of our new Faxon Outdoors brand. Uh, this is the Icon series of bags. The one you're holding is a 50 liter IPX7 waterproof. Uh, this is a submersible bag, actually. Yeah, we'll go down. So the little purge valve on the side there. So uh, this is something we started uh, getting into and building and prototyping a little over a year ago. Started shipping a, around Black Friday this year. But uh, you know we found a, a space in the market where people needed a, a high quality, durable, lifetime guaranteed type bag that had these capabilities such as waterproofing and so on and modularity. But you know we're a high value brand, just like our firearms brand. You would be getting this bag at another name brand at $500 up, $800 up. This bag, full-blown retail is 209 Oh, no uh, kidding. So this is IPX7 rated. 
um, again, removable straps, you got zipper stays, and those are German T-zip zippers uh, that uh, allow them to be fully submersible and again, hold that IPX7 rating. And it is a lifetime guarantee bag as well. So just like our firearms products, proof of purchase, any problems, uh, those get replaced for you. So we currently have a 50 liter duffel, a 30 liter backpack that's also waterproof, and then a 30 liter backpack that's water and dust resistant. That's more of like your everyday carry kind of hype along yeah. fabric bag. Um, and the both waterproofs are 209 full blown MSRP. The water and dust resistant uh, comes in at 139. Um, so those uh, launched around Black Friday. You can find out more about those either on the Facts and Firearms website or you could go to factsandoutdoors.com and they've started to pop up at various dealers uh, across the country and online. So uh, we're looking to launch about 15 to 20 new products in this line this year. Awesome. So as, as far as it, firearms, there's a bunch of new stuff coming. So does the Icon series uh, with Facts and Outdoors. Well, thank you. Thank yeah. you for putting up with my crap. Thank you guys for watching. I love you.